Hey everybody, this is Peter. In this video segment, we're going to perform a Linux network service scan with Nessus 4. So we've done this before with, uh, um, I guess, on the Windows side of the world for Windows operating systems. So we're going to do this now using Nessus 4, but for a Linux operating system. So let's go ahead. We'll create a new policy. And we'll name it Network Process Audit for Linux. All right, so we'll go into credentials here. And we're going to choose not Windows credentials, but SSH credentials. And we'll type in our administrator username and password, in this case, our root username and password, so that we get a much, thorough, a much more thorough scan. We'll go ahead and disable all of the plugins and only enable the plugins that we need in order to gather and enumerate the actual uh, services running on the Linux system. So we'll go into service detection and let's just find the right, uh, the right plugins that we actually need. We're going to go ahead and click on remote listeners enumeration. All right, so we're going to go ahead and save our new policy, highlight it, and click on Scan Now. And again, we're going to skip through some of the scan process. This typically doesn't take too long when you're scanning one system anyway, but we'll go ahead and bring this down now. As you can see, we found, obviously, um, the Nessus service running, as you can see here, and it shows us which folder that this actual service is running in. Um, which is the typical or the standard folder. We'll highlight HTTPS as well as you can see where HTTPD is running and the same thing for SSH. So again, quick video for you guys just to show you um, how easy it is to actually discover and enumerate the actual services that are running on a Linux system. Thanks very much for coming out guys. We'll definitely see you on the next one.